Hello friends. Welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to make simple social media lower third in After Effects. So let's have a look. Let's start. Create a new composition. Name it as the logo. Let's import our logo. Add it to the timeline. Now let's create another composition. Name it as Facebook. Add the logo composition to the timeline. In effects and preset search for fill. Add it to logo composition. Change color to white. Let's scale the composition. Press says to bring up the scales. Scale it to 50%. We need to change the position of logo, so position it somewhere here. Press R to bring up the rotation. Create a keyframe for rotation. Change value to minus 1. Go 20 frames forward. Now change the value to 0. Press S to bring up scales. Create a keyframe for scales. Now come back to start of the timeline. Change the value to 0. Press U to bring up all created keyframes. Select all keyframes. Change keyframe assistance to easy ease. Adjust the speed graph. Go to one second. Select the shape tool. Draw shape as shown. Change fill color to white. Press S to bring up the scales. Press Y key and select anchor point and place it at the position shown. At the start of the timeline create a keyframe for scale. Change value to 0%. Go one second forward change value to 100%. Select all keyframes. Change keyframe assistance to easy ease. Adjust the speed graph. You can see the preview. Now let's add our text. Here I am using Biba's new font. You can download this from below link in the description. Place the text near to the bar shape. Press Y key and select anchor point and place it at the position shown. Let's draw the shape layer in such a way that covers the whole text. Change the fill to light blue. Place shape layer below the text layer. Press S to bring up the scales. Press Y key and select anchor point and place it at the position shown. Create a keyframe. Change value to 0. Go up 2 seconds. Change value to 100%. Select all keyframes. Change keyframe assistance to easy ease. Adjust the speed graph.
you can see the preview. Press Ctrl plus D to create duplicate. Change fill color to white. Trim the shape layers at 20 frames. Place the above shape layer at 16 frames. Press Ctrl plus D to create another duplicate. Place it at 17 frames. Select Shape Layer 3. Change Track Mat to Alpha Inverted Mat. Here you can see the preview. Create another duplicate of the Shape Layer. Place it above the Text Layer. Let's trim the Text Layer at 20 frames. Press P to bring up the positions. Create a keyframe for the position. Go at 1 minute and 14 frames forward. Create another keyframe. Come back to the first keyframe. Now let's position the text. Position the text as shown. For text layer. Change the track mat to alpha mat shape layer 5. Now you can see the preview. Now let's add our follow text. Go at 2 minute. Draw the bar shape as shown. Trim the shape layer at 1 minute 10 frames. Press S to bring up scales. Press Y key and select anchor point and place it at the position as shown. Create a keyframe for scales. Change value to 0%. Go 7 frames forward. Change value to 100%. Let's add another text. Draw the shape layer in such a way that it covers the text. Adjust the shape if need to match the size of bar shape. Press Y key and select anchor point and place it at the position as shown. Let's trim the shape layer and text layer. Place the text layer above the shape layer. Change the fill color to blue. Press S to bring up the scales. Create a keyframe for scales. Go at 2 seconds create another keyframe. Come back to the first keyframe. Change its value to 0. Select all keyframes. Change keyframe assistance to easy ease. Adjust the speed graph. Press Ctrl plus D to create a duplicate of the shape layer. Place it above the text layer. For the text layer change the track mat to alpha mat. Let's see the preview. Now let's create another composition. Name it as Facebook. Add the FB composition. Go to Layer. Time. 
Select Enable Time Remapping. Go up 2 seconds. Create Keyframe. Go up 3 seconds. Change Time Value to 2 seconds. Delete the default created keyframe. Create end keyframe. Change value to 0 seconds. This will create the reverse effect. Let's see the preview. Similarly, you can create this for your other social media links. This is all for this tutorial. If you like this video then leave a thumbs up and your valuable comment and if you are new here don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any query or question feel free to comment below and you can also contact me on any of the social media given in the description. Thank you.